We find the defendant, Hannah Gutierrez, guilty of involuntary manslaughter as charged in count one. She showed no emotion, even as she was led away to jail. The armorer who put live ammunition into the gun Alec fired, killing Helena Hutchins, was convicted nearly two and a half years after the onset tragedy. Just relax. I'm so scared. I'm yeah, you're all right. Just relax. <laughs> Sheriff's body cams caught Hannah Gutierrez Reed that fateful October day. How do I know this is a gun? That's the gun. Prosecutors said she repeatedly ignored safety protocols that could have prevented Helena's death. This was a game of Russian roulette. Jurors deliberated less than three hours before reaching the verdict. You got to take responsibility, especially when you're handling weapons and you're in charge of those. That's, that's your job. During the trial, this previously unseen video from the set in New Mexico was played in court. One more, one more, one more. I forgot to recoil stuff. No, no, right away, right away. Let's reload. Here we go. It showed Alec firing a prop gun and asking Hannah why she didn't have more weapons ready. We should have had two guns and both were reloading. But when it came to that fateful moment inside the church on the movie set, Alec first insisted to police. I need to know, how did that happen? Where did that bullet come from? And then he said this to George Stephanopoulos in his only sit-down interview. Well, I didn't pull the trigger. Someone is responsible for what happened, and I can't say who that is, but I know it's not me. So what is next for Alec? Just last month, a grand jury indicted Baldwin on involuntary manslaughter in the shooting that he has pled not guilty. Kelly Kraft covered the trial for Court TV. She's in Santa Fe. Kelly, Hannah Gutierrez-Reed goes to jail. What does this mean for Alec Baldwin now that some accountability has been taken? It means a lot for Alec Baldwin because right now his attorneys have a roadmap to exactly what took place in this case for his upcoming case. He had one of his attorneys here in the courtroom the whole entire time. So they're going to be able to take everything that took place here and use that for their trial going forward. And Alec is a producer, not just the actor. Does accountability have to be taken at a higher level? Is that what really we're facing in July? And that's exactly what defense counsel was arguing throughout this whole entire trial, Billy, that Hannah is a scapegoat the lowest person on the entire movie set. So defense counsel was saying that yeah, somebody else is responsible for what took place here. In 2022, Alec's wife, Ilaria, spoke exclusively to us. We're not OK. We can't be OK. No one's OK. Detailing how deeply she and Alec feel for the family of Helena Hutchins. The loss of Helena. She was an incredible, incredible woman in so many different ways. It's been a life-changing year for, for every single person that was involved that day. Alex's attorney previously told Extra, it is unfortunate that a terrible tragedy has been turned into this misguided prosecution. We will answer any charges in court. Alex's trial set for July. Hannah, who has said she will appeal, could face 18 months in prison.